Hi, John here from BOIS. Just giving you a quick demonstration of how to install your MT4 and your indicators, as well as your templates and your sound file. So we just go ahead and click on the FXCM link here. Then click Download MetaTrader 4. Click Save File. Then you click the down arrow here, click the, you're going to install it, click run, click yes, I agree, next, okay, it's going to download the files, you can just close this tab, Disregard this. Don't need that. So it's going to download the files. Somehow it's like it's done, but it just sits there for a bit. You just got to click in here and get the next button to show. Hopefully it doesn't do this on your PC. Okay, click finish. Okay, then it's going to open up the uh, MT4. So what you're going to want to do is go to File, Open Data Folder, MQL4, Indicators, then you are going to go to the desktop where you should have saved all the files which I emailed to you in a one email so you can save those to your desktop in a folder or to a different folder of your choice so you're going to go ahead and open that up then select the two exe files ex4 files rather BOIS JWB and BOIS 60S. Select those two, then Control C, copy. Go back to your FXCM data folder, indicators. Control V, paste that in. Then you're going to hit back twice, one, two. Go to templates. Back to your folder here on the desktop, and you're going to select the two templates, 5 minute and 60 second, control C, copy, select here, control V, paste those two in, alright, so we got that done, next, we're going to go to my computer, start computer, C drive, program files, and select FXCM, MediTrader 4, sounds, and we are going to go ahead and go back to the folder on the desktop with the sounds and put the sound files in there okay and the sound files will probably be 
a different for when you get emailed. These are subjects to change, but I'm just showing you how to do it. So you would just drag the files in there, like so. Just click continue. Do this for all six items, yes. Okay, done. So I can close this now. And go ahead and exit your FXCM because you need to restart it to be able to get the ex4 files to load Alright, so now that I got those in there, should be all set, so I can go ahead and just make sure all my pairs are there. Go to File, New Chart, select the pairs I want to add. And just like so, use the own JPY, I can go ahead and add that. Make sure it's on Minute Chart, right click template. Go ahead and select five minutes. And there it is. There's the arrows. Chart is set up, ready to go. If I wanted to make it 60 seconds, I could right click, select 60 seconds, and there it is. So you just repeat the process for all of the pairs. And you want to go ahead and draw your support and resistance based on your main pivot points. If you find that the line is red like this, what you want to do is go ahead and double click it, select horizontal line properties, and change it to a nice like uh, medium gray so it's not so loud. So object as background. So there you go. Got it set. Don't like these red lines very loud. All right. So if you need to move, adjust, just double click and drag, and turn this off so you can scroll back and fix your SRs. And you want to go back uh, quite a ways. All right, so all of your main pivot points here. Put your SR just like this. Pretty simple. A little bit tedious, but it can save you. Can get you a lot more wins when you set up your SR properly. All right, so that's that. And that's pretty much it. So. 
you have any questions, let me know. And what the other thing you can do is go ahead and alphabetize your pairs to make it easier. So you've got uh, odd USD, then we've got euro USD. Like so. Great British Pound, USD, and so on. When you're done with your SRs, just click the, make sure these two are selected so that the chart shift is on, and you're ready to go. All right, so thanks for watching. Look forward to hearing good news about your trades. Happy trading.